This room is actually great. By the way, already know if you already know about this guest room, this guest room will give you insane number of customizations, but without any customization hub. I mean, no specific dedicated section for all those customizations. One of the best rooms I think I've ever liked. It's called a nameless room, and yes, as I just mentioned, no name. I always say that this room has no name. So yes, sometimes it's just kind of sarcasm. But this is what we have: Android 12.1 nameless room official version, which I'm using right now on Mi 11X. Want to talk about some few things about this room so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end uh, like other custom rooms for example pixel experience or evolution xos pixel plus ui etc it will also give you the pixel launcher pre-installed and if you don't want to use a pixel launcher simply ignore and install launcher or any other customized launcher if you want to the quick settings panel is what you can customize very easily without having to root in your device without having to install any kind of magic module for that as you can see this is the quick settings panel which i have you can customize the rows and columns if you want to it's up to you the option is available in settings which we will talk about later on other than else things are basically same if you are able to see the theming here yes i have applied custom monitor theming that's also present i am not using the wallpaper based thing if i move on to the settings option and as i just mentioned at the starting of the video if you take a look at it, you don't have any specific hub for the, all those customization things all the customizations are already available in some sections for example if i move on to the things network internet does not have any kind of things here if i move on to the apps section and game settings and this is where we have the gaming mode what about the gaming mode the gaming mode is also quite good this gaming mode is actually not available in all the customs and this is the gaming mode which i was talking about the gaming mode uh, i saw this gaming mode was in exodum ui if you have ever used exodum ui you already got to know and this is the gaming mode which you have if i check out this game space yes this is the gaming space which you have by default available and this is actually quite good too other than else if i move on to the other things for example moving on to the settings apps and here after the gaming mode you have the option for launcher switcher which means you'll be able to use any other launcher application downgate that's quite useful you can install the older version and unlimited google photo storage that's also quite useful same kind of that if i move on to the notification section you have the notification bar related customizations heads up less annoying in call vibration options are also quite useful so basically all the useful things and all the customization based things whichever you are looking for almost all the things are present in this nameless room Moving on to the battery settings, you can see the battery usage from the last full charge instead of the 24 hours switch. So that's a little bit disappointing. The option should be there, but that's okay. Battery icon you can customize very easily. We have two extra icons options available with including this battery percentage. We have icon landscape left and icon landscape right. Other options are just kind of same. I always use mostly the landscape option. So that's why I have chosen that one previously. Other than else, almost same kind of things available here. Sound and vibration are basically in sound. You have this specific option for touch feedback. This is what I liked a lot. Absolutely. You can simply enable the specific options where you want haptic feedback or where you don't want that. That's quite useful, which I didn't saw in any other custom room so far. But maybe we will see this in later upcoming videos. We have the volume dialogue related customizations. We have other options, including related to this display etc display has the custom carrier label which you can enable i had enabled previously which was working perfectly fine even in the lock screen and status bar both that's good you can simply enable this option the option i was i was using from past five to six years with flat style bar indicators that was quite useful other than else and this is where we have the quick setting styles layout customizations and this is what i was talking about i made a video already on this i actually told you about this and as you can see quick setting tiles which you can customize without labels you can use the labels with the vertical layout also let me try to enable this option too okay this is how it is looking like yes you can customize these things you can customize the rows you can customize the columns and this is quite good even you can customize the quick settings quick quick settings portrait this kind of thing we have three rows quick rows we have available you can customize this to two or four so basically one of the interesting things what we have some customizations like status bar customizations and theming customizations which you mostly get in almost all the customers i'm not talking about this as anything unique because all the customizations which we are seeing 
here like icon shape icon customization etc etc all these customizations are already present in most of the customers but one thing is that they have a specific hub and this will not give you any specific hub for sure other than else almost same kind of things wallpapers and styles you just saw security etc has the face lock fingerprint lock app lock whichever you were looking for already present system update it also give you the ota update i made a video yesterday or maybe two days ago about which are the rooms which have the best ota updates those rooms are different from this one but yes you can still give it a try system navigation the best choice maybe if i move on to the gesture navigation we have the option to customize the pill length we have the option to customize the pill radius so yes you can even disable the ime button space it is actually one of my favorite features and i've already considered about this one in some videos that you need the pill like ios style pill and you don't need that space below keyboard this option is absolutely best and this is available by default in this gesture option swipe to screenshot option is already there you can use this thing if you want to quite useful i always use this feature on my devices most of the times that i think so a lot of users always use these features on their devices too play by control secure power menu advanced restart yes you need this you need to boot into custom recovery you need to boot into bootloader mode you need advanced restart that's already there ignore window secure flags you'll be able to take screenshot in some restricted apps so that's absolutely absolutely useful you don't need any magic model for that and you don't need to root your device by the way if you have installed this home and you didn't root it your device and looking for safeness status it's passing no issues in that thing including that as i just mentioned the google photos has unlimited storage so we will talk about that for sure but as i just mentioned no specific hub for the customizations maybe one of the good choices for you to try it out on a device and yes just to show you that if that option is working perfectly fine or not i have enabled that option for unlimited google photo storage and in the google photos app you can see the pixel can back up unlimited photos and videos at no charge that's just working per per perfectly fine here you can back up your photos from this device as unlimited and no cost etc monet settings i just forgotten to show you that's why i'm here back again the monet settings are also working perfectly fine if you just saw the wallpaper has different kind of colors but you just saw the red colors everywhere because i tried the custom color and that was working perfectly fine you can even use the pure black theme so if your device has amoled display and want to use a pure black theme that will work for you for sure sure i tried that it was working perfectly fine after disabling the monet settings after disabling the custom color settings you just saw this is what we have and these were things i just want to let you know about this latest for this latest nameless room update if you want to install this room on your device if it is available for officially for your device go and install this right now if it is available unofficially you can go and check out for your source on telegram or xda and this is about today's video this is all thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video until then goodbye Over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the edge